Hello everybody, Average Gamer here, welcome to another episode of Supreme Ruler Ultimate as the So Sudan. So I'm just trying to do some trading here. Um, trying to get a little bit of money, more money into our systems. Um, trying to get Pershing and Mounted Infantry from the Americans. If I can get, if I can get better, better infantry units... One, six, four, and six, and six. No, they're the exact same. Son of a bitch. Seven, seven, and four. The tank's better. The tank's way better. Okay, we're gonna build six of them. Russia's gone to war with Kazakhstan. Okay. I don't know if we're going to be able to pull this off, to be honest with you. The way I'm looking at this... They have a military that's massive, whoops, massively larger than ours. They're fighting the Israelis, but the Israelis are going to probably go to war with, like, Libya and some other countries around it. And we, on the other hand, need to kind of build things up a little bit. I can't build anything there yet. The rail is starting to get built, which is good. The roads a little bit as well, which is good. France has declared war in Albania. Uh, yeah, we'll support that. Hmm. One point nine percent unemployment. Yeah, I don't think we have the ability really to go to war with anybody around our, around us right now. Like, even if we wanted to, they have number us two to one in Sudan. I love my coffee. The only way really we could get involved here would be... Probably. To move troops in at the last minute. When, you know, we bring up this number here. And this number is at, say, 40. When they've been losing a lot to the Israelis. Who just declared war on Turkmenistan? I don't want to get a bond. Are they are they at war with anyone else, like the Russians or anything? They're at war with Russia, Sudan, and Turkmenistan. So we're at war with them, obviously them. Then Sudan. And our main process right now is we really need to get our supply in order. We're hurting for supply. But we need to get the supply up so we can start building up our, uh, our, our infrastructure, I guess you could say. Right now we can't build anything there. Can't build anything there. I'm kind of contemplating. I'm like I can't even build a military facility here with supply depots. I want to be militant. I really want to be militant, but we just don't have we just don't have the, the capabilities for it. I'm gonna scrap our plan to. Uh, to go to war with Sudan for now. I know it might be stupid because we're going to lose out on these oil fields. Possibly. Uh, what I'm going to do is to, like, pretty much, when I get to a certain point, these Moags here, actually. How many of them do we have? There's four there. Is there any of them over here? 
Oh, there's two more. We're gonna leave them. Leave those two there. We'll move these four actually up to this town here. And then I'm gonna get the better supply vehicles. Yeah, these things one, two, three, four. And deploy them to this town as well. Turkey's declared war on Israel. Oh, Australia has reached a space milestone. Okay. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, so that's going to be the, 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 I guess you can say, the plan for the short term. Get our guys, get them in base, get them based up. Um, I'm, I'm going to try and get another, another trade deal. Fingers crossed. Um... Military is costing us five million, but our treasury is costing us thirty-seven. Construction itself is costing us thirty-six million. I don't remember what we're building. Oh fuck! I almost forgot. Uh, theater overlay. We have a lot of stuff here that needs to be repaired. Probably. Yeah. They have no infrastructure over here as well. They're like nothing. Like no industry, no nothing. All we can do at this point is make trades and hope. Dominica, yeah, okay, whatever. basically kind of hope that we can kind of play this as well transports okay hope we can kind of play this a good way I guess you could say you get all these guys in this military base once they get to this base, we're laughing. Okay, yeah, let me guess. Treasury shortfall, okay. Yep, we're gonna cancel out these, uh... Yeah, we can't afford that right now. It's one of the shitty parts of playing as this country. There's so many growth opportunities, but it's going to take a while for our infrastructure to catch up. Our roads will link on to there and there. Russia's gone to war with the uh, with uh, Ukraine. I'm actually shocked that the uh, I'll say the volatility of the game. I think this is because of the most recent patch. And this game is being massively, massively, massively uh, really volatile. So we got about there and there for. Is that close enough to our coal yet? Nope. Outer ore. Not even close. Once we get ore and stuff, we are laughing. Because so we'll have ore, we'll have petroleum, we'll have coal, and we have power. Like, we have all the things we need. We just can't access two of them. Uh... It's one of those things where it's, I feel, feel like we're being hindered. Who just got eliminated? Whoa. It's a good thing we didn't do what we were going to do. Israel has surrendered. 
to Turkey. Wow. Okay. That uh, wasn't expected. Turkmenistan took what was Iran. Turkey took Egypt and a whole bunch of other stuff. Wow. I'm a little nervous, and they're at war with Russia still. Russia... Well, fuck. France is going to take the Germans soon. Just look at that. That's a guarantee. I don't know how this is going to turn out. I don't think we're going to last long. Everyone's being extremely violent and aggressive. And, uh... I can't see us being able to even defend ourselves right now. Like defending ourselves right now is a uh, is already going to be a bit of a problem. Uh, no, I wanted you tried to sell me prawns earlier. Damn it! So I said half my oil reserves. You're like one of the only few countries that still likes me. And they said no. Russia's gone to war with India. Okay, so basically, well, um, I can't see this lasting too long, much longer, actually, to be honest with you. The plan was to have a nice playthrough as a, a peaceful country, slowly building up a little bit, you know, bringing the country out of the Stone Age and all that stuff, and uh, I, <laughs> I was not expecting this to be every country for itself mode. I want to say this is free-for-all, but... Uh, Luckily enough, it's not. Let's move you guys to there because you probably run out of supply. Nope. What now? Nice. All right, we're all going to stay there for the next little bit. Well, I also contemplate the meaning of life. Got wish I got more of those piranhas from Germany. Critical goods. We're critically short on consumer goods. We're also seven million dollars in debt at this point. Um, we can raise taxes. That's not going to do much. We're five hundred grand now in debt. One point three million in debt. Uh, France and Serbia are gone to war. Just watching our oil tick down. I don't know what uh, what to do, to be honest with you. I don't even know what we're building that's causing all these problems. I think it's... Is it the road construction, maybe? No, we're not building anything. Production's costing 12 million, though. Why is production so bloody expensive? I'm gonna turn you off. Oh, shit, is it those... Make sure there's no. Uh, what? Oh, that on turn on. I didn't even remember that I even started building those things. Those are 
not a good idea to build right now. Uh, Taiwan and Russia signed a uh, peace agreement. The Maldives and Russia are going to war. We'll, we'll get rid of you. Guess it must be our oil production that's causing all the... Yeah, consumer goods. Yeah, I, I know we're critically short on consumer goods. We had no money to buy them. We, uh... Huh, I think we're in a... Bit of a, we'll say, a conundrum a little bit here. We don't have the ability really to do much. Well, I can take out some loans. Pakistan and India are at war. Wow, I'm shocked actually right now. Just like how this this game's gone. This, I think I got too aggressive a little bit. Um, oh, there we go. We're making money now. There, they're gone. This we're making a little bit of money. Looks like it's from our trade. Really not too worried about consumer goods because we're charging so much for them. Now we're eight million in the hole. Missed construction, but we're not building anything. Nothing agriculture. No rubber. No timber. No oil. No coal. No ore. No uranium. No power. None of you. None of you. And we're not building any there. What are we building that's causing this problem? Makes construction one million. And I guess production is the power or the yeah, we're gonna turn these off and see if that overly affects everything. Yeah, they dropped four million off. Kind of wish you could you could figure out your production, and it would show you exactly what's costing what. Because we don't have any agriculture. Like a lot of the stuff we we just don't have. I know we're building roads. We're not using, nor are we selling rubber. Tim we actually have a lot of timber. I'm going to try and sell some. Top importers are India. Let's try Turkey. Well, you're both only going to give me half. Countries that like you will give you better. Germany is the only country that liked us. In the world. Really. Oh, uh, because we also hedged our bets with, with Japan as well. Or, um, sorry, Israel. So the two countries we hedged our bets on... 
both are not going to exist soon. Well, another drink of my coffee. Which one neutral? That kind of sucks. Ceasefire between Myanmar and Russia. France has gone to war with the Ukraine. France has gone to war with Antigua and Barbuda. Bar Barbuda? That doesn't say Bermuda, but I thought I was saying it wrong. Okay, well, we're going to start supporting France. Because at this current point, there's really not much we can do. I mean, we're slowly clawing ourselves out of uh, out of the basement when it comes to money here. But yeah, I'm gonna put a pause, or a little cut in here. So uh, what we're gonna do? I was gonna go yellow with everybody else, but we don't have the supplies, we don't have the money for it, we we don't have the infrastructure for it, anything like that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna build up. We're gonna do the original plan. I should not have changed it. Uh, the original plan was to build the country up slowly. And then, over time, conquer everybody. We're going, we are going to go, this is going to be a more warlike, more like playthrough. But first, we need to get our bases in place. We need to get our bases in. So, with that in mind, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.